When you first open personal accounts, it is blank. All the uh, windows are blank, there are no entries, and there are no accounts. You have to create these yourself from scratch. Before we uh, begin, we'll just move some windows together so that we can see them all in the same view. And I'm using preferences, a second type of preferences called windows, and to do this. So there we are. In accounts, select um, an account, and you can use add or insert. Type the name of the new account. Now that account's immediately available for use, so if we set it up with a, an opening balance, opening, oops, opening balance, uh, there we are. To um, do a transaction, we need another account. Let's create another one. We can use add or insert again. Uh, wages. So we're going to make a transaction from wages to bank uh, 200. And there we are, first transaction, and there's the totals in the accounts. Notice that wages is negative because the type hasn't been set yet. So in the database, we set it to type income. Create some more accounts. Some services. Electric. Gas. And pay those bills. So we will pay from the bank to electric. And likewise from the bank to gas. And you can see their totals. Now we're going to create a category, or rather, or a category or a group heading, in the same way because everything in personal accounts is uh, an account. So there we are. We can drag electric into that and gas into that, and the total of outgoings now is the total of its two um, accounts it contains. And in the like fashion, we can create an income category and put the um, wages in that. And that's uh, our first simple bank example. Ah, notice the income also needs to be set to income, as does wages. There we are. Thanks very much. <laughs>